In this quick video, I'm going to show you how you can bookmark a Google document. So I'm in my drive and I'm going to open a document. So this is something that I'm working on and I want to bookmark. So right up here where the URL is, this is called the Omnibox. And in here is this little star. And this is how you add a bookmark. So we're going to click that and then it's going to give us some options. So now we need to decide what we want to name it and where we want to put it. So it's teacher tutorial, Google Sheets. I am just going to get rid of the Google Sheets part and just call it teacher tutorial. It'll take up less room. And then um, I need to figure out if I want to put it into a folder that I already have or if I just want it on the bookmark bar all by itself. So for this one, I just want it on the bookmarked bar. I don't want it in one of my folders. If I did, and I don't see my folder that I want to use, I could go down here and, and do choose another folder, and it will show me all of my folders in my bookmark bar. And then you click Save. All right, so you're looking and like, hey, where'd it go? I have a lot of bookmarks. So right here, this little arrow, click on that, and that will bring up even more bookmarks. And if I scroll down to the bottom, here is the teacher tutorial. Now, I want that up on the top. So all I have to do is click it, not right click, just regular click. Click it, and I can drag it up, and I'm going to put it right there. So there's my teacher tutorial, and it's right here where I can get it. If you notice, some of my bookmarks are just pictures, and you can do that with a you can do that with any bookmark you have. So if you right click on a bookmark that has an an icon that you can recognize, so like this, I know this is Paramount, I know this is University of Dayton, so I can recognize the picture, and I know this is Keep. So I don't need to have it say Keep or University of Dayton, and it just gives me more real estate for these. So I'm going to right click on, on this bookmark because I know what that, that symbol is. I know that picture, and I'm going to click Edit. And I'm going to completely delete the name. So I will only have the little cloud picture, and then I'm going to click Save. And there we go. So if I hover on it, it will bring the URL uh, in case I forget, um, but I know what that little icon means. So that's how you add a bookmark and a little tip on how you can make your bookmarks just look like little pretty pictures.